I've actually made a, a zip for it, I will upload this as well to the video. Mm. So, um, here, um, this is our encryption, which I have already in the last tutorial showed how to remove most of the stuff so it doesn't break and it still runs normally. Uh, but today we're gonna actually remove all of the useless stuff uh, that's in there. So for that we're gonna just here disassemble this. We don't have to wait this long. And now we can see already here it's full of bullshit. Um, I'm going to uh, just simply use a JMP tool to remove all the JMP code tools because it's pretty much spammed with it and I'm annoyed by it. Um, it's gonna take a short while. And afterwards we're gonna use a new tool which has been released by NNNH actually which you which I'm gonna show here. Oh actually his name is not it's not featured here. Oh here it is by NH. Uh, it's really good. Uh, it's really good for fixing LASM. And I'm gonna use it here as well. And so on we have this lozen which has which is full of, of uh, blockers which I've told in the, in the last one what are blockers so I'm gonna show in here um, these blockers uh, I've already looked at it before like this is also just spam you can remove this so I'm gonna scroll down we're gonna find where our important stuff is and we can see here there's something set ranges Here's the results, but what we want to find is the important part here. Mm, it looks like there's a lot of spam in here, which I want to remove. Um, I'm not sure. I'm gonna look for base 16 because that's the encryption uh, that is used in this one. So we're just gonna for base 16 we see here's base 16 you can see here also the string for the decryption it's important uh, if you see this you can basically say which kind of base 16 encryption it is but this is really simple um, then we're gonna go here and I'm, I'm not going to decrypt the anti-log stuff and shit here I'm just gonna decrypt everything else uh, and so on you can actually scroll this, just scroll through. It's gonna kinda have anything here. Here we have F0, we're gonna keep that in. And then delete everything up until here. And then we have here the important part. We see the base 16 is here set up set up and from here off there's already the blocker again. Which goes down until I think. Where does it go down to? I think until sixty thousand or something like that. It's really far. Right, let me let me just go for this. Here somewhere starts more blockers. There's a lot of blockers in here, and then where where does it start? I know that the anti-logs are somewhere here. Yeah, here's some stuff, but this is not this is not encrypted, so I don't even know if I have to remove this here. Where let's just let's just go from here up to one. So jump to line while you're holding this. Or just two. And then we're gonna scroll around. Select all of this, 
see this is the formula actually when you see the string word here for base 16 it's pretty obvious it's really easy for base 16 so just gonna remove this with delete line because sometimes this is fucking around so we see here this is please uninstall some bull fucking bullshit very easy to remove so the next part is here we go load to needle is again the start of the blocker it's it's just a lot of spam and here we go we have this and test is the end of the blocker and we delete again and then below the script you'll be able to see the blockers again and from here off i'm going to actually remove everything to the end of the whole fucking script we only want the script we don't want these one zeros this is probably one zero blockers what we have on the end this is function start function end i have fixed it obviously but that's just the point ah uh, how long is this i'm not sure i've done this before so i mean shouldn't be too long yeah, how long actually holy fucking crap okay it is long that is unexpectedly more than i thought it would be all right i'm gonna just go through this it shouldn't be too slow with it yeah we're all using 16k let's wait until it's down there bam, bam, bam. i'm not gonna edit this video just so you see the whole fucking process i'm doing here all right that should be done here we see the last one i'm gonna remove like this and this is basically it because we have a start of the function right here function f0 right here and what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna change this to 250 that's basically it that's all we need stuff is not important uh, and now i can basically just compile this again something is wrong the function f203 is Okay. Oh, there's a closure. I, I, I didn't. Okay. Yeah, well, we have to obviously remove this closures. Not sure if the closures are all there. Yeah, okay. This is, this is time. Okay. And then it will tell you this. If key is package installed and some stuff that doesn't matter, this error, we don't need that. Now I'm gonna also put in the zip uh, the Alabi SS tool because I think it's the best one. And there's a problem with the script. I'm gonna actually show. Um, tutorial here, and then we have this 10 KB file, and then try to decrypt. We see length out of index, and I'm gonna show you just my normal ignore code settings, mm -hmm. which works. We have load cakes, load pool, load meal. A lot of a lot of stuff here all, all of this i have activated just copy these settings mostly i work and after you've done this you can just basically go here then press ignore codes and it works and now we can go back and here we are so this is basically it we can see here this is all it is And now we have the important stuff, the values, which are encrypted with base 16. You can see here, all of them. And I have a decoding tool for this, which is a tool.l1, which is with the formula. I'm gonna this time decode with this, with this tool, because uh, I don't want to do it manually right now. Like it's the same way to do it. But I'm gonna show you the next time how to do it. This time I'm gonna just use this tool and gonna show you how to use these tools as well. Because some people just don't get what the fuck is meant with functions and stuff. If you go here, 16, and it wants a function name. So what is the function? Well, as we've seen, there was a base 16 there before the values. So this is our decoding function. We're gonna press base 16, and now there it is basically it and boom 
there's our values, all is decrypted, everything is fine. The stuff like L6 and 219 is mostly the GGs or OS and stuff. We don't have to decrypt this now, but this is basically it. And here is the decrypted file, which we have. Yep, that's basically all there is. Hope you enjoyed. Have a nice day or night. Thank <laughs> you.